What's good, YouTube? It's Missy's World. I'm on my way to Miami to get my BBL Lipo 360 at New Life Plastic Surgery. I know, I know, I'm so excited, all right? I know this is a video you guys were not expecting, but I'm really gonna get right into it because, listen, there's not a lot of videos about where to go, where's the best place to get your body done. Like, before this, I thought, I literally was gonna spend $15,000 $15, on the BBL in Boston. And I did my education, I did my research, and this amazing doctors in the US, guys. I know a lot of people go to the DR, Columbia, and there's nothing wrong with those areas, but I'm not Spanish speaking. So other than day, if I'm gonna have somebody cut up my body, and uh, you know, this is my first time going through surgery, I wanna make sure I'm understanding whoever is operating me, if that makes sense. So day one, I'm on my way to the airport. I'm really excited to update you guys about my journey, about my healing process. And I'm gonna post music, I'm gonna post vlogs, I'm gonna post real shit because I'm, day, like, you know, I'm a real bitch. And there's not a lot of people who's doing what I'm doing. And like, let's just be quite frank there's a lot of girls on Instagram posing that they never got nothing done when we know they got something done. So that's that. You heard it from this channel, and I'll see you guys in Miami. So I'm on my way. Miami, as you guys can tell, there's a lot of like nerve-wracking things that you think about the day before your surgery, but I know everything is gonna go well. What's going on? Here at New Life Plastic Surgery, I just did my pre-op, went so smoothly. I gotta show you guys this amazing building. My surgery is tomorrow. Look how crazy this building look like. Amazing. We up in here. And I can't wait for tomorrow. YouTube, I'm here at my hotel. I booked at the Cambria Hotel. It's about 10 minutes away <laughs> from New Life Plastic Surgery. Come on, look at this view. Look at this view. Look at this view. I'm here at the Mall des Americas in Miami. Basically getting some last minute things that I need um, for my surgery. So basically I was told, okay, yes, you need sweatpants and stuff like that, comfortable clothing, but I definitely recommend ladies, like if you're getting anything done, make sure that you guys get loose fitted dresses, like very comfortable cotton dresses um, within your first couple of days, because I'm telling you, you're not gonna wanna move your legs at all when you get anything done. So that's one thing I wanted to tell y'all, but I'm at Marshall's, I'm here to get a robe and um, some comfortable, you know bedroom slippers so i could be you know not moving around and just being in comfort you know and getting some socks well i need to get some compression socks but anywho that's basically what i'm here for so let's i'm gonna look for some things and i'll be back so i just arrived my hotel room i just wanted to show you guys how it looks like so this is the entrance as you guys can see um gives you a little nice living space Space over here, it's a nice little mirror, right? And then we got my bedroom, all right? Bedroom is nice and spacious. I'm not like for the price of $130 wow. for a last minute one day hotel I'm gonna stay at is not bad at all. I'm gonna also show you the bathroom. Sorry about my room being a mess. I did a little bit last minute shopping, but this is how the bathroom looks like, you know. Has a nice like shower, you know what I mean? Nice and cute. Can't be a little too bougie. It's only the day before my surgery, so I may not come really ball out right now. Today is officially operating day. I'm so excited. I'm really excited. I don't even know the words to even say, but I really can't wait to show you guys the results, show you guys the process, and let's get. Um, I already, as you can see, I already changed into. My outfit that I'm gonna wear for surgery. Um, so far, the process has been amazing, very fluid. Loving it so far. Uh, I'm so excited. I brought a candle for my doctor. You gotta show appreciation sometimes, you know? So I'm excited and I can't wait to show you guys the result. So, y'all, I really had a whole video recorded the day after surgery. And, guys, I was in pain. This is the first day. Um, I tried to take a picture. I was very, very swollen, as you guys can see. But the first day, I thought I could run and walk. Until the second day, I felt like I couldn't walk. I, I felt like I was in the worst pain in my life. I felt like 
10,000 cars crashed and, and hit me. And please, please uh, excuse the dirty mirror, okay? This was in the recovery home. Yeah, I stayed at a recovery that. home as well. I'll give you that information. I actually can do another video on that about recovery homes and everything like that. But this was the day after surgery. I was really feeling how I was looking. I don't know why it's not showing the full video, but all right. But story time, just letting you guys know that um, this was the day after surgery. I was in pain. Um, and after 24 hours of surgery, guys, you have to do something called a lymphatic massage, which is going to hurt a little bit, but at the end of the day, it's going to make you feel better. So a few days after surgery, I linked up with my brother, Jaleel. He is an artist, and um, I got to see family, which was great. We were all in Miami. He was outside, vibing. My mama Duke's over there. And just enjoyed some of my time that I was in Miami. I wasn't able to, you know, go out to the beach or, you know, go into the water because after surgery, you need to wait until your incisions close. But it was still a vibe. I still enjoyed my time that I was out there because I stayed in the recovery home for about like six days. And then I stayed at this hotel, which is called the Hotel in Miami, for a few days. And there he is, Jalea. Yeah, so I watched my brother perform at home, which was super, super good. Yeah. Really great accomplishment for me and my family. And yeah, that's my vlog. Stay tuned for my next video, y'all. Cause just let me know what Yo, you guys want to see the for the next video. Alright.